My name is Remini. I am the new AI narrator for Out of Focus Outdoors. Welcome to the channel. If you remember in the first episode of the season, Benny mentioned a review of a trail camera. Benny along with Jamie went back to check on it the following day, mostly to see if the camera still worked. The evidence showed the camera was fully operational. Although Benny jumped the gun and didn't capture any pictures of any wildlife, so he waited a few days and checked again. This is where I leave you and Benny will take over on the review. This is the asshole's review of an use a good trail camera. Hi guys. We're uh we're gonna go get the SD card out of that trail cam. Finish the review up today. Clear. Oh. So my uh, partner in crime's driving over here. <laughs> Yet. Yeah. Keyword there, my friend. Yet. But yeah, we're gonna go grab that SD card and uh, bring it back to the dialogue room. Pop it in the computer and see what we got. Check y'all in a little bit. All right, guys. Back out here on the property again. We're gonna check that one trail cam. Set up two more. There it was. Uh, DRT Extremes. Get them a done. They come in a two pack. Actually, not bad for the price that I got them at. Hopefully, they have to work. So, we're gonna set those out. I've got the spare SD card in my pocket for the DL. I want to say 502, whatever it was we set out yesterday. That's what name of it. called You So Good on Amazon. You So Good? You So Good. You So Good. <laughs> you So Good with me, damn good. <laughs> oh. Slow walk it here for a moment. Check out this beautiful fucking property. Gorgeous.
All right, guys, so <clears throat> here's the deal. I know I said that I would check back with you guys when I got to the property. Well, I'm sorry that didn't happen. I got to looking at deer sign and everything else and I forgot to record anything. But I did get those, uh, we've got three trail cams out there. I did get those swapped out. Uh, oh yeah, don't mind the stuff on my hands. I've been busy in the kitchen making some stuff for uh, content I think you guys will enjoy. Well, actually this content will be releasing after. So currently I am in the middle of the process of making that ballistic gel with the uh, fake organs. So, let's uh, let's get on with this ooh so good. I, I think I'm pronouncing that right, I'm not for sure. But ooh so good. DL502, I think. But, let's check out what we got here. Okay, so here we've got some of the images. Um, you can see, of course, it caught some of us when we, uh, last time we swapped out. And this is when we were like, wow, that actually is pretty good image quality for, you know, an Amazon Find Trail Camp. Wasn't bad at all. But that was after day one when we went back out there because we really wanted to make sure the thing even worked and did its job before we did it, which is why we're not finishing the review until just now. So let's get on to the next bit. All right, so here we have the first one. We only get just a couple little ears here, which isn't too bad. And then we've got one ear right here in the bottom. And this is the night after we swapped out the SD card. This is March 14th. Well, technically the night of. I mean, it really depends on how you look at time. And then here, we got a couple of ears. And that's mostly because the deer are very curious about the trail cam. Which tells me another piece of information is that they're really young. And then here we finally get to see, I mean, it's real hazy and you got to look close, but you got the outline of one over there and then another one there. And then of course the ears of this one that's been right up on the camera the whole time. And then ear, a back, another back, and another back. So this image shows four all together. And then we got one in the background here, and I'm guessing this is our curious fella here. Oh. And then of course, you know, we've got an ear, and then two more over here feeding. And then we have three of them in frame in this one. We already determined we're probably gonna move this trail camera down and get a better angle over this spot. But this is the spot in the pilot episode I was talking about. They always come through. For some odd reason, there's a trail, which you can see the big ATV trail here. My old ATV trail come down through the creek and so on. But then there's another trail here, another trail here, another trail off behind the camera, and another one over here that comes in from behind the camera this way. It's just like a central meeting point of four major trails that they use. And then this is same deer, it's just this one dropped his head. I'm assuming this one's mama because while these eat, this one's a very attentive. But I can't really tell from the brow structure or anything else if that's mama or if that's, you know, the buck. But it's for Kentucky, that is actually a good sized deer, that one is. The other ones are a little bit on the small side. <clears throat> You'll see here, this one's more attentive and looking backwards while the other two are still feeding. 
Now while it feeds, this one's more attentive. And now I'm just scrolling through pictures because I'm just seeing what all we got. Mr. Curious is back. And thanks to his ears, I can't tell if that one that was in the picture just prior is still down there or if this guy here is the one that was down there. But see, now that one's down there again. And I've seen four bodies earlier, so I'm thinking these three are over there feeding. And I've got one right next to the camera feeding. It's my assumption. Is my assumption. And then here we have you know peeking back in we get a little bit of an eyeball on this one and now over here which if those two are still over there this one's obscuring the bodies and then we have this one here which judging from this one's brow structure here I'm assuming this one's a buck go back and now we just have one and now y'all get to enjoy the images of <laughs> me coming in to what I'm doing with my phone there is I'm marking on an app where the trail cam location is but this is me coming in to swap the card and that's pretty much it I mean it was an Amazon find that Jamie come up with it wasn't a bad one at all. It really wasn't. It performed very well, surprisingly. I'd never heard of the brand before. Uh, he found it on Amazon. I'll get the price off of him before the release of this video and I'll put it down in the description. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Who's so good? DL502. Good fucking camera, man. I am in shock. Well, that's it for this asshole's review. I'm Benny. Here's to a good season. Due to YouTube guideline changes, out-of-focus outdoors will no longer be censored.